Shannon here, your content engagement specialist with Coldwell Banker Distinctive Properties, starting a brand new social media tips and tricks series. Be sure to follow us on YouTube so you don't miss any of our wonderful videos that we are going to be putting out for you guys today. So without further ado, we'll get started. I wanted to go over real quick how to set up your Facebook business page if you haven't set that up already. So to connect to the social um, back at you, you will need a Facebook page. You can get walked through that when you go to connect, but if you'd like to set up your page first, this is how to do that. So when you're on your home screen, you'll go over to the left-hand side and you'll tap the button that says pages. If you don't have any pages, you won't see any pages obviously, um, but you should still have this create new page button. So you'll go ahead and click on that. It'll pop up where you can create your page. Go ahead and name your page. So we'll go ahead and call this uh, test page here. You want to select the category that best fits your page. So this one we'll go ahead and put in um, real estate agent just for kicks. You can go ahead and put um, a description here, agent in Grand Junction, since that's where I am. Um, obviously you can put a little bit more descriptive. I think there is a character limit. It looks like down here at the bottom. So just make sure that you're sticking with that. Go ahead and click create page. That'll take just a moment to set up and load for you. All right, so now your page has been created. Um, so you can go ahead and um, go to your pages tab. Um, you can do that from this bar here at the top that says pages. You can also go to your home page and go to pages over here. Either way, you'll get to it. And we'll scroll down. There is our test page. We'll go ahead and open that up. So you can go ahead and create your username here. You can upload your profile picture. Sorry about that. Uh, you can go ahead and add your cover photo, put in all of your details. So it'll walk you through um, what details you can add here. Um, introduce your page, invite your friends to follow you, anything like that. Um, and then you can go ahead and set that up in Business Suite. I do highly recommend using Business Suite. One, if you don't have your Facebook business profile connected to Business Suite, you'll get an error message when you try to connect to Social Back at You. Um, and you can also do a lot of fun um, things in the Business Suite as far as managing your profile. You can create a um, look at your content. You can look at your different recent posts, the analytics here, um, your insights, things like that. It's got a lot of really good information for you on the business page once you've got it connected to the business suite. And then once you've got this set up, go ahead and make sure you get that page connected to back at you. So you've got content that is pre-scheduled, pre-set up, it's unique to you and you can get rolling on that. Thank you guys so much for watching. And again, don't forget to hit that follow button down there on the YouTube page and make sure you are checking us out every week as we bring you the latest and greatest tips, tricks, and how-to guides for your social media. See you next week.